Let's talk semantics for a minute. We've had questions from around the world that have asked, what's the difference between stride and swing? Well, in a nutshell, stride should swing, but swing doesn't necessarily stride. Now, while you're thinking about that, let's talk about a couple of definitions from some of the greats of jazz. Yubi Blake. When we asked Yubi uh, years ago, how he defined the type of music he played and uh, the type of jazz that was originated in the early part of the century. He said, we called it ragtime and swing and jump music. He was referring to everything from rags to Harlem stride to boogie woogie and all of the different styles of music that he played he said we use those terms indiscriminately, back and forth. Uh, as we mentioned in a previous video, the term stride may not have really appeared until the 1940s. Um, so his definition of the type of music that we're talking about um, could either be referred to by the original players as ragtime, swing, or jump. Now somebody asked Charlie Parker in a radio interview one time, uh, they said, Mr. Parker, is the type of music that you play called bebop? And Parker said, I play music, man. That's what I play. So all terms aside, let's try a little exercise in stride. I'm going to play, I'm going to improvise on a blues pattern in the stride style. There's no given melody, and we'll just take it as it comes. And one of the aspects that I like about stride is the fact that stride a piano uh, can has the capability of building a groove and really growing in intensity uh, as it continues to go through the piece so let's try some blues in stride and see what happens mm -hmm. 